Hello and welcome to another month's monthly marvel. My name is Steve M. Nash from selfhelpcollective.com and smnash.com. This month I'm going to share my understanding about Napoleon Hill's words. The world has the habit of making room for the man whose words and actions show that he knows where he is going. The world has the habit of making room for the woman whose words and actions show that she knows where she is going. Napoleon Hill I'm not sure where they, this quote came from, but it's likely it probably came from Think and Grow Rich, a somewhat revolutionary self-help book in the early 20th, published in the early 20th century that I've read a couple of times. And it's quite an amazing book, pretty much about the, the power of thinking, the power of intention, the power of who you surround yourself with. It's kind of a, a self-help mantra, really. This, this sense of, if you know where you're going, things happen. So there, therefore, make sure that you know where you're going and you, you strive purposefully and you, you push through things and, you, and you, you shake people's hands with force and you, you make things happen and it's very rah, 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 I think. But there's a truth, there is a truth in, in what Napoleon Hill is talking about. And it's basically this, that when you make space, some quietness, let the crazy thinking settle down, you listen, you hear, you know what to do. And sometimes you hear that it would, would be a good idea to do X or to do Y or to do Z. And it really makes sense, doing X, Y or Z really, really makes sense. And you just go for it. Not because you, it matters to you, not because it's you against the world, not because it will mean something when you achieve it, because you just do it because it's right. It's right. It's right for you in this moment for you to do this. When you act from that place, then I think you'll find the world, the universe, others fall into line. Allow you to go in that direction, support you in ways that you could, not, you could never imagine. Things just fall into place, synchronicities. It be, it's easier. And it may not even go in the direction you thought it would, but it's going in the direction you enjoy it going in. When you do this action, you take this action from the right place, from listening, from doing what's right, not what you think is right, not what you think you should do, not what, what others tell you to do, not what the guru tells you to do, not what the internet marketer tells you to do, not even what your coach tells you what to do, what you hear yourself telling yourself to do, what's the right thing. The right thing could be to act, the right thing could be to wait. But when you act from this, this right place, this knowing, this inner, inner wisdom, this intuition, those types of actions, it's amazing when things fall into place. It just becomes easier. As Napoleon Hill puts it, the world has the habit of making room for the man whose words and actions show that he knows where he is going. It's not a self-help mantra. Don't force this. Instead, 
wait, listen. You'll know, you'll know when you're doing the right thing. You'll know because there'll be a feeling of rightness and you'll know because strange occurrences will happen in the world which allow you to go in that direction, which make it easy for you. You'll know. Napoleon Hill's words are a barometer of, of your right, the rightness of your actions. They're not something to pursue, they're just a measure. They're a measure of whether you're going in the right direction or not. I found, anyway. Let me share those words again with you. And then I'll say goodbye. And you can leave a comment or not. Depending on what you've heard from this video. Okay? The world has the habit of making room for the man whose words and actions show that he knows where he is going. Napoleon Hill. One thing before I go. I am recording Weekly Wonder videos again. Re-recording the ones I recorded in 2010-2011. And I will stop recording those videos in 2016, July. Which is also coincides when I stop recording Monthly Marvels. July to 16. July 2016. This just seems right. I've shared myself in video. I've developed my ability to share in the moment. To speak without erming. to have pauses and I feel it is a time for me to share in a different way. We shall see if the world makes room for my actions. We shall see. But right now, it feels like the right thing to do. So this is just me sharing an, a small example of how I'm taking the right actions. And right now, nothing much is happening. I'm just recording these videos. Not many people are watching them, not many people are commenting, but I'm enjoying it. Some people watch my videos on my smnash.com blog. Sometimes they, they're moved enough to contact me and they become a client of mine. And that's useful and that's lovely. And sometimes people just enjoy the videos. And again, it's a form of giving. I enjoy making the videos. I'm, I love it that people can get something valuable from it. That, that's enough. We'll see what the world does to support my next, the next phase of my sharing. It just won't be by video and it won't be by blog post. Who knows what it will be, but we shall see. Anyway, thank you for watching this monthly Marvel. I shall be recording another one next month and the quote will be, because I'm very organised, it will be a quote by Marcel Proust. Please leave comments, please. And expect a weekly wonder in a couple of days. Okay, thank you. Bye-bye.